Yo guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another video of Munchkin World today. Now, we are going to be completing the Bakayoko Footy SBC. Has been released, got a 91 rated card, um, 82 pace, 83 dribbling, 92 defending, 94 physical, 82 passing, and 75 shooting. Compared to his normal card, this is a big, big upgrade. Um, and all you have to do for this is one Premier League player, one French, uh, one French player with an 86 overall so if we go to the premier league and we'll see what a highest rated player that we're not currently using is uh, if we go gold low to high that's probably where they all are um right, so we can use body and i need a french player I only need 60 chemistry as well, so if we just go goalkeepers, um, gold, again we'll go low to high because I don't know, 85, 85, alright so we use super sitch, um, Kimmich we can use, I may need to use some of that Rami, may need to, let's just check the price of him real quick before we actually list him up. Uh, 40k, 38k. <clears throat> There's around 35k. Um, actually, we'll keep him on the bench for now. We'll see what others we can use. Obviously we ain't using first man. Right, we'll come back to centre backs. Uh, left backs. We've got Marcelo, which I could use, which is an 87, plus it puts the rating up a little bit. Um, oh, I've got to until I have FIFA and I just. Right, CBM, 82 rated. Right? Mm, centre mids. Could use Kovacic at the moment, seeing as he is a higher rated. That would be pretty decent. Um, which I'm actually tempted to do, you know. Because he's what? Let's think about this, he's only like 30k. And I'm never going to use him. So why not use him? Uh, cams. See what untradeables we got because that's probably where most of my high rated players are going to be. Sendio 84 strikers again. Got to check the untradeables because I don't even I don't even know what good in this club. Yeah, you see, we don't have many strikers to be fair. Um, I mean, I could use Grand Christ, because I'm not going to use him, and he don't even sell for that much. So we could use him. 82. 82. Joe, oh, let's use Bakayoko. Seeing as this is the one we're doing it for. Why not use him instead? Uh, right, forwards. So I could use Pedro. That's an 85 rated team. Let's see what forwards we've got. Low to high, real quick. Not as high. Untradeable. Um, obviously, we're not chucking any of these in. And none of them really make it worth it. Right, let's see. Gold Hartiller, who's the highest rated? After that, it's farming at an 84. Or an 84 work? No. Right, so let's see what we've got loads of fire. We've got Leno at an 85. We've got Alexandro at an 86. So let's see if 85 works. No. It does an 86. No. It does an 85 instead of an 84. No. Right, so I'm thinking for this. 
I may have to use rain. And then I could possibly take out like Actually can we take out no. Can we take out Alexandra? We can but we lose chemistry. What about Grand Quest? Yeah. Right, I think I'm just gonna submit it like that. I know obviously I could do it a lot cheaper. But for the purpose of the video, I mean like I'm never gonna use Rami, do you know what I mean? Or Marcelo or Kovacic. Or this version of Bakayoko. So why not submit it? Um so yeah, Bakayoko completed. Actually look, so I'm gonna compare him. Let's have a look at what he's got. He's got 99 shot power. But his shooting is absolute trash, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, finishing a 59. Penalty 68, volley 55. Obviously, where you want him is like CDM. Like 93 slide tackles, 95 standing. 90 marking, 92 interceptions. Got 97 stamina, 92 strength, 96 aggression. So they're very sort of like... If you need that defensive player in your back line, like in your sort of midfield, like as a CDM, then I'd suggest doing it. Because he actually just looks pretty decent. Right, so let's go ahead and find him. There he is. Right, now compared to Firmino, obviously Firmino's more attacking. Um, compared to Matthias, Matthias has got the better attacking stats, but Bakogo beats him on the defensive. And compared to Vieira, again, Vieira pretty much wins on all stats. Comparing to Perlo and Rooney, see, but even comparing him to that that Rooney, but apart from defending and physical, like Rooney just smashes it. So yeah, I mean that's that done. It's another pretty decent attacker. Obviously, the next one will be the left backs, which I think I already submitted, and I think I used Danny Rose just to keep Alexandra as a high-rated card, which was a smart move by me, if I do say so myself. Um. But yeah, I don't think there's anything else in it. Nah. Right then, so that is going to be all for the video, guys. Uh, thank you for watching. Hopefully you guys have completed this Bakayoko card yourself and are starting to get more back into FIFA with the footies being active and EA actually releasing some decent content for once. Um, it makes a change. We'll see. Personally, for me, FIFA has died a little bit, but this is sort of like rejuvenating it. Making the game not good again, but like fairly interesting again. So yeah, I probably will be doing quite a few videos on FIFA once more, which is pretty good. But yeah, that is going to be all for this one. So thanks for watching. If you are new to the channel, please subscribe. I really appreciate all the support. And until next time, take care.